Welcome to another one of our Bluebeam Me Up How To tutorials, brought to you by Brighter Graphics Limited, where we show you how to maximize the potential of your investment in Bluebeam Review. Brighter Graphics are the oldest established Bluebeam partner and your premium Bluebeam solutions provider. Let's get started. In this video, we are going to show you how to use Quantity Link in Bluebeam Review. Quantity Link lets you seamlessly link measurement totals from PDFs to Excel templates for streamlined bid calculations using your own predefined formulas and formats. On this document we have quite a few markups of various types. You can set up links for all of your measurements from areas to counts. As an example, we are going to link measurements for different size ventilation ducts to a pre-made estimation template that will calculate the cost based on the formulas that are set up on the Excel sheet. You can see the lengths of the ducts are all listed here in the markups list. With the subject lines reflecting the different sizes used, we are going to be linking each size of duct to the sheet for the estimate. There are seven different types on this sheet. We will open Excel with our pre-made bid template for ventilation takeoffs. We can see the template has a material type label, an open field for the measurement, the current material price, and a total cost field for each item as well as an overall total, for both length and cost. We will need to set up multiple quantity links. One for each cell in the spreadsheet that we want to pull data from. While it may be extra effort up front. We only have to do the setup process one time, and then we can use the same template again and again. Provided we are using the same types of tools. We'll set up our first link in the 12 by 12 cell since we want to calculate the total of the 12 by 12 lengths. Right-click the cell and select Quantity Link at the top of the context menu. Then select Create. Because we have yet to link PDF files to this Excel template, we are prompted to add our files before creating the first link. Either individual PDF files or entire folders of files that we want Quantity Link to use in its tabulations of the data. Doing the latter allows us to get all of the totals across all of the files at one time. Clicking on Add, we will select our combined takeoffs PDF that we have been working with. Click OK. To create the link, we need to tell Review exactly what measurement we want to tally here, including what columns we want to pull the data from. For this cell, select Length from the Total drop-down. In the next drop-down, select Subject, and then the 12 by 12 Subject option. Change the cell name to Length 12 by 12. Click OK. Keep in mind that Excel requires cell names to start with a letter first. You will see that Quantity Link automatically generated a total length of 43.46 feet, which is the same total you will see in the markups list. Notice that the blank cell next to the measurement total automatically fills in with the measurement type. In this case feet and inches. If this blank cell didn't exist, it would overwrite the immediate one next to the linked cell. Now we will follow the same process to create the rest of the quantity links to the length of the ducts. Once we've done that, you can see it not only updated the total in Excel for the cost of each type, but because there are already formulas in Excel based on the cost for the materials, we have a running total length and cost as well. Thank you for watching. We hope you found the video useful. You can visit our website, www.brightergraphics.com, for more videos in the how-to series and all things Bluebeam Review. We at Brighter Graphics, welcome your feedback to help us to improve. 